if me see a machine like on a video I come up like with a structure for try get it but then I mean a welding machine and then I can't really do welding but I know a little bit about woodwork so what I do I go and every time I see something I try to construct it using wood I copy the idea show my friends of them they share the views if it could work we can work and then thing so here it is my own backyard gym homemade sweat and hard work sweat and hard work and just a drive drive to lifting and actually wanting more lifting everybody does be amazed everybody does be amazed with the kind of work put in behind here by me and my friends and me a kind of guy you know me not, me not a guy we really don't use to align pony black much uh i will make a pretty key future because i might could have happened so let's like, just say like this actually saved me from some sort of bad things like with the Audi. Me fall in love with it. So from falling in love with it and then thing it take up more time. More time like behind here than for actually put me panny black. For actually put me panny black. So most of the time I mean the behind here take up to because me love this. You take up a certain kind of discipline. Take up a certain kind of discipline from doing this. Because then if you have certain results, then you can do certain thing. You need more rest time. You have to stay away from alcohol and thing. And obviously if you go pan if you go pan the black, way that you don't want to do it or not to, you might get peer pressure for do it. You don't want to do that. So behind here behind here take up most of my time if me have um like any money and stuff me actually go start a gym but then me now want to like start a gym for like bring in like different machine and different thing I want to start a gym like exactly like behind here I want to use like same boards of them and it seem make a museum because probably if me have more space if maybe have more space it will be a bigger operation by far and it will be free it will be free because we can't really say price people so it will be free and then me know me know my me know my arm um, like you know my background now everybody could actually afford a gym because if, if you could like go like like you could like use a gym but because the funds in that day you can't get to go a gym so you understand so then if we could at least do that they get something bigger and then everybody could come and walk out freely that okay with me so yeah, definitely one more for sure. So by so by um like watching videos, different videos, different videos, we get for construct, construct because it make a plenty failure, no like make a plenty failure like from building stuff because then sometimes not, not, not me one actually I use the gym so then from building the stuff for them going up going up me I get like me might build something wrong and then when somebody else go there and use it you never think so how for my friends of them to kind of give me you know 
look at ideas because we might have one idea or we might two heads better than one resources are always kind of tight here and even in like those plush gyms in town I've had opportunities to go to those but I really I would prefer this I hope they don't cancel they don't bust me when I, if I go to fitness <laughs> but I'm saying I, I much rather prefer this because it, it, you kind of get that communal sense you see the importance it has within the block within the village within the guys that are putting the sweat in not only they're in the exercise but also like in the maintenance of the gym and stuff like that this really shows you that there's like really no excuse to like get up and get after it especially because all the stuff is handmade, all the stuff is like locally sourced, it's recycled. Like if you go to like backyard gyms up in Georgetown on the leeward side, it's all dependent upon the location they're on. Like if the weights are unbalanced or something like that, like you got, like you were saying, like life is unbalanced, but it really shows like the resourcefulness, so like in that real world resourcefulness to kind of like adjust. Like you might not hold it in the center, you might have to adjust your grip, or you might have to know like you can only do it for a certain amount of time, or you have to hold it a certain way. And I know it's a good, and it's, I'm glad like, people like yourself are, sh are highlighting it because it shows it's, it's what also, not only within St. Vincent, it's very, very doable to be so resourceful. People have that internal strength within to kind of take it to the next step. You have to use what you have. So you can't complain and say like, well, oh well, such and such bar too heavy. Forget about the excuse and just go and do what you have to do forget about the excuse not come up with no excuse whatsoever forget about that and then largest largest gay work done largest gay work done and here a couple of guys in the gym a couple of guys in the gym you probably might have doubt it and say thing but today all of them get results from the same way within doubt, the same way they didn't say might are too heavy, the same way with half balance. Today that gave me results and give them a look what they want today. So just not complain when you come in the gym, just admire the hard work we get done and just push. Cause and uh, yeah, yeah, people just come and say like yeah, this feel how this feel half side too. Just, just say push and you go get accustomed to it and then like grind on grind on don't complain at it again because you have to realize everything it'll be like a man make everything and not perfect not perfect so just utilize I just have to utilize where I have and then get everything done